नमस्कार दोस्तों वेलकम बैक इन आवर यूट्यूब चैनल स्टडी एट एजुकेशन इफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर एनी कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जामिनेशन डू सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन फॉर गेटिंग ऑल द नोटिफिकेशन ऑफ आर अपकमिंग वीडियोस इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम आवर इंडियन हिस्ट्री विच इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम यूर एग्जाम परस्पेक्टिव सो वॉच टिल एंड ऑफ द वीडियो एट द एंड ऑफ द वीडियो आई विल गिव यू वन क्वेश्चन विच यू हैव टू आंसर इन द कॉमेंट बॉक्स यू कैन ऑल्सो डाउनलोड द पी डी एफ फाइल ऑफ आर वीडियो लेक्चर फ्रॉम आवर टेलीग्राम चैनल लिंक आई विल गिव इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द वीडियो द वेरी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज इन विच ईयर स्वराज पार्टी फॉर्मड द आंसर इज इन नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी थ्री On 9th January 1923, the Swaraj Party was formed. The Swaraj Party was established as Congress Khilafat Party, uh, which was the uh, political party. And the leader of the uh, Swaraj Party was Chitranjan Das, and the founder of the Swaraj Party was Chitranjan Das and Motilal Nehru. Motilal Nehru was the father of Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. And finally, the seized operation happened for the Swaraj Party in 1935. And what was the motive of Swaraj Party? So the motive of the Swaraj Party was great. self government and political freedom for the indian people from the british raj matlab ki india ke log chahte the ki hum khud ka sarkar banana chahte hain aur hame political freedom chahiye british raj se so this was the motive of swaraj party let's see the next question who was the last governor general of free india the answer is c rajgopalachari his full name was chakravarti rajgopalachari one more question arise from here who was the first governor general of british india the answer is lord william wentick so keep remember this ki lord uh, lord william wentick was the first governor general of british india let's know something about the c rajgopalachari this is the picture of rajgopalachari and he was born on 10 december 1878 on torapalli agraham and he was died on 25 december 1972 in chennai his full name was chakravarti rajgopalachari as i told you and he was also the former chief minister of tamil nadu and founder of swatantrata party and swatantrata party was existed from 1959 to 1974 so keep remember this point let's see the next question universities in the presidency town in india were established in the correct answer is 1857 in 1857 universities in the presidency town in india were established sir what is this presidency town so by the mid of 18th century there were three presidency town madras bombay and kolkata so sir how this presidency town formed so during the period of company rule in india that means from 1757 to 1857 the company gradually acquired the sovereignty of large part of india is called the presidency town matlab ki jab east india company bharat pe rule kar rahi thi from 1757 to 1857 तब वो भारत के छोटे छोटे हिस्सों पे अपना अधिकार जमा रही थी तो उसको हम लोग बोलते हैं प्रेसिडेंसी टाउन लेट्स सी सम नेक्स्ट पॉइंट ईस्ट इंडिया कंपनी वाज फ्रॉम 1612 टू 1757 एंड ब्रिटिश राज वाज फ्रॉम 1858 टू 1947 एंड इन 1947 फाइनली वी गॉट इंडिपेंडेंस लेट्स सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्थ द टर्म निरंगाथा इज एसोसिएटेड विथ द आंसर इज जैनास द टर्म निरंगाथा इज एसोसिएटेड विथ जैनास एज इन हिंदू रिलीजन इट इज़ लाइक मॉन्क मुनि साधु एंड इन मुस्लिम रिलीजन इट इज़ मौलवी सो सेम एज इन द जैन रिलीजन इट इज़ निरंगाथा here it is given that nirangatha is composed of two words nir means without and grantha means a bond or attachment so uh, nirangatha which means one without any bond so keep it remember let's see the next question question number 5 The Turko-Afghan rule in India lasted for about the answer is 3 centuries. The Turko-Afghan rule in India lasted for about 3 centuries. Let's see some fact related to the Turko-Afghan. Founder of the Turkish Empire in India was Qutbuddin Abak. Keep remember the founder of the Turkish Empire in India was Qutbuddin Abak. Even though it was Muhammad Ghori who established Turkish rule in India following his victory over Prithviraj Chauhan in 1192 he did not rule over India. मतलब कि 1192 में मोहम्मद गोरी और पृथ्वीराज चौहान के बीच में एक वार हुआ था जिसमें मोहम्मद गोरी जीत गया था और वो इंडिया पे तुर्की रूल एस्टेब्लिश कर लिया था बट ही डिड नॉट रूल ओवर इंडिया नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज मोहम्मद गजनी वाज द फर्स्ट तुर्की कंक्वायर ऑफ नॉर्थ इंडिया ही अटैक्ड इंडिया सेवेंटीन टाइम्स बिटवीन वन एंड वन थाउजेंड 
मतलब कि मोहम्मद गजनी जो था पहला तुर्की था जो कि नॉर्थ इंडिया पे अपना अधिकार जमा लिया था एंड ही अटैक्ट सेवेंटीन टाइम्स ऑन इंडिया बिटवीन 1000 एंड 1027 थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी सेवन ई डी और ये जो अटैक किया था सेवनटीन टाइम्स ये धन के लालच में किया था मोहम्मद गजनी सो कीप रिमेंबर लेट सी द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन पुलकेशन टू वॉज द मोस्ट फेमस रूलर ऑफ सो आंसर इज चालुक्य से पुलकेशन टू वॉज द मोस्ट फेमस रूलर ऑफ चालुक्य से पुलकेशन टू वॉज बॉर्न इन कर्नाटका एंड डाइड इन सिक्स फोर्टी टू ए डी इन बदामी बदामी वॉज ऑल्सो द कैपिटल ऑफ चालुक्य सो कीप रिमेंबर Uh, the successor of Pulkeshin II was Aditya Verma. His father name was Kriti Verma I, and his uncle name was Mangalesa. This is the picture of Pulkeshin II. One more question can be asked in your exam. What were the common languages of Chalukyas? So the common languages of Chalukyas were Kannada and Sanskrit. So keep remember that. Let's see the next question. Velu Thampi led a revolt against the British in the state of. The answer is Travancore. Velu Thampi led a revolt against the British in the state of Travancore, and that revolt took place between 18 December 1808 and 19 January 1809. And in that revolt, British were the victory. Ah, uh, Velu Thampi was uh, full name was. वेल्यू uh, धान चंप करमन थाम्पी ही वॉज बॉर्न इन सेवनटीन सिक्सटी फाइव एंड डाइड इन एटीन नॉट नाइन इन दैट रिवॉल्ट ही डाइड वॉज द धालवा और प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ द इंडियन किंगडम ऑफ त्रावेंकोर बिटवीन एटीन नॉट टू एंड एटीन नॉट नाइन सो की प्रिमेंबर वेलू थैम्पी वॉज द प्राइम मिनिस्टर और धालवा ऑफ त्रावेंकोर बिटवीन द एटीन नॉट टू एंड एटीन नॉट नाइन लेट सी द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन To which king belongs the land capital at Sarnath? The answer is Ashoka. Ashoka king belongs the land capital at Sarnath. Ashoka was the greatest king of Maurya dynasty. He was born in three not four B.C. in Pataliputra and died in two thirty two B.C. in Pataliputra. And his house was Maurya dynasty. His reign was between two sixty eight and two thirty two B.C. And his father name was Vindusara and his mother name was Subhadrangi. Uh, he had five wives maharani devi uh, sandhi mitra padmavati uh, tissi raksha and kuruvanki so keep remember let's see the next question who is known as the father of local self government the answer is lord ripen lord ripen known as the father of local self government this is the picture of lord ripen lord ripen passed a resolution in 1882 which is often called as mangal uh, manga cart of local self government and thus he is rightly called as father of local self government matlab ki lord ripen 1882 mein ek resolution pass kiya jisko manga cart of local self government bola jata hai us samay se isko father of local self government mana jane laga after independence rajiv gandhi brought uh, that local self government scheme through the uh, constitutional amendment of 65th and 66th तो पैंसठवा और छाछठवा कॉन्स्टिट्यूशनल अमेंडमेंट के द्वारा राजीव गांधी ने लोकल सेल्फ गवर्नमेंट का स्कीम फिर से लाया था तो इस चीज़ को भी याद रखिएगा लॉर्ड रिपेन जो था लॉर्ड रिपेन वाज द फॉर्मर ब्रिटिश सेक्रेटरी ऑफ स्टेट फॉर स्टेट फॉर वार इसको भी याद रखिएगा लास्ट क्वेश्चन कलिंगा वार वॉज फोर्टीन द आंसर इज टू सिक्सटी कलिंगा वार वॉज फोर्टीन टू सिक्सटी कलिंगा वार इज नोन एज वन ऑफ द ब्लडिएस्ट वार इन आवर हिस्ट्री which starts on 261 BC and fought between Ashoka the great Mauryan emperor and ruler of state of Kalinga and where it fought it fought in Kalinga which is now part of India it is in Odisha state and this war ends on 261 BC only and what the results happen Maurya compromises settlement that means Ashoka the great Mauryan uh, compromises settlement As I promised at the end of the video, I will give you one question which you have to answer in the comment box. The question is: First battle of Panipat was between option A, Prithviraj Chauhan and Muhammad Gauri; option B, Ibrahim Lodi and Babur; option C, Babur and Rana Sanga; and option D, Akbar and Hemu. So, its answer you comment box. Me, give me. If you like our video, please like our video and subscribe for more videos. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a good day ahead.